I have the great pleasure now of being joined by Dr. Matthias Dutzkaver, who is involved in one of the late-breaking clinical trials. Tell us a little bit about it. We're going to present for the first time the results of the Powder AF trial, which is a multi-center, randomized, controlled trial in patients after pulmonary vein isolation for paroxysmal atrial fibrillation. The patients eligible for the study were patients at three months after the pulmonary vein isolation while still continuing the antiarrhythmic drugs during the blanking period and presenting free of atrial fibrillation at that time point, three months after catheter ablation. And then the patients were randomized to either continue this antiarrhythmic drug therapy at three months until 12 months after the ablation, or they were randomized to stop antiarrhythmic drugs at that time point, three months after ablation. And the primary endpoint was the incidence of documented recurrence of atrial tachyarrhythmias based on halter monitoring at three months, at six months, and seven day halter at 12 months. Now the results for the trial uh, were the following one. We observed for the primary endpoint being the recurrence of atrial tachyarrhythmia, we, we observed a significant reduction in the incidence of recurrence of atrial tachyarrhythmias in those patients that continued antiarrhythmic drugs. So as we look forward, it sounds like it's going to be more wise to be prescribing these drugs. What other impact do you think it's going to have on the field? Well, the, the impact is as follows. Maybe it will not per se change the strategy of the treating physician because if a patient has recurrence after the pulmonary vein isolation, the patient and the operator can still decide to perform a repeat ablation. But now at least we know that adding drugs, even previously ineffective drugs, that those drugs might now work sufficiently to prevent recurrence of arrhythmia. So what this trial adds is a new treatment strategy. It validates, it validates the concept of hybrid rhythm control ablation with drugs. Whereas in the past we were always talking about either ablation or either drugs. Well, congratulations on all your work and research and thank you for being here. Thank you, with pleasure.